tell us a little bit about the, the training that you've been doing and, and how you found it, basically. Yeah, so I think my biggest focus was to not necessarily do a whole bunch of one RMs or anything like that. It was get my body better and fix the weaknesses so that over the next sort of six to 12 months, I can start to, to break through those, those former plateaus. So it's like just exceeded everything. <laughs> like I sort of expected to sort of just, just come in, do my sessions, have a bit of homework and then sort of yep. go away. But like after the first session, little things that you sort of tweaked from that first get go was just like, hang on, maybe he knows quite a lot more <laughs> about about than, than what I know with, with, with my background. I used yep. to think that, um, not necessarily have, had an ego, but used to think that I could do my own programming, but yep. straight away. What is your background? I've got a sports science degree, yeah. um, been personal trainer for the last um, seven or eight years, yep. um, as well as been in a couple of rugby programs. Yep. I thought of the concept to the leaking energy with my, with my squat in particular, something such as really small as just the angle that my pelvis was at, I guess, my hips. We sort of stripped the bar back to 60 kilos and just got everything right and then sort of progressed up, whereas yep. before, all my, back, my lower back was sort of getting jacked up after every single squat session, yeah. every deadlift session, and it's a tiny little pelvis, um, pelvis adjustment, and then getting my breathing right as well with that yeah. brace in has really, really yeah. helped. That was the other, sort of all just clicked, like even the other day in our second last session, or yeah. third last session, yeah. and yeah. Well, that's pretty, good, and that's you know, what you're talking about, that, that whole bracing sequence and, and force transfer and elimination of, of leakages and efficiency and things like that. That's, 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 athlete, that's, that, that's being an athlete. Yeah. I think it would have pretty much just looked the same as what I was, what I was doing before, which definition of insanity, trying to <laughs> expecting a different result from the same, doing the same thing over yeah. and over, as well as I wouldn't have had like weak, di different things in my shoulder, like my external rotation, yeah. um, things like that. I wouldn't have had somebody identify those weaknesses yeah. to then work on. I just would have, would have thought, oh, my shoulder's a bit cooked, I'll roll it out yeah. a bit. And you're having your eye on me the whole time. Yeah. I found in, in some programs, nothing against team programs by any means, but the coaches generally looking after sort of 30, 40 He's blokes got a big job. in a weight room. There might yeah. be a couple of interns, but they, can't, they don't have that time to spend one hour Absolutely. fixing Sam needs transfer of force and his power clean. They, yeah. need to be, they need to be sort of close enough is good enough if he's cleaning at okay weight then then that's okay he's ticking yeah. that box but it sort of leaves that little bit of that room for improvement sort of untouched like we we're talking about you know that five ten percent yeah when you get to you know an elite level five or ten percent it's you massive know, yeah exactly and if we can if we can improve your your numbers on the bar by five or ten percent and, and 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 you know really reinforce that that uh the way that you need to display that on the field so that it's a takeaway for you, yeah. then that's our job done. You yeah, know? absolutely. That, that's going to put you five or 10% ahead of where you would have been if you hadn't, if you hadn't come. And that's exactly what our program's for. Yeah. But if anybody who's sitting on a fence as to whether they should, they should come in, just, just do it. <laughs> Try it. If it's not, if, if you don't like it, then you can leave. No yeah. one's, no one's going to chain you up and keep you here. So, um, you got, yeah, you've got nothing to lose by, by coming in and, and getting somebody, an expert in their field to sort of have their eyes on you and, and make a program for you with that one-on-one -on -one attention out of a group setting to- A little bit of love. Thank you. Yeah, a little bit, little bit of love, yeah. <laughs> Good stuff. Yeah, yeah exactly. Easy. Good, Good work. Luck, Thanks, mate. <laughs> Cheers.